Hello guys! We are making a rocket today. And we're gonna use the real liquid jet fuel. Just the same like in real rockets. Kerosene plus liquid oxygen. No one has ever made this before. Indian rockets! First we need to buy some carbide. Such a big canister, guys. Holy moly. That will be enough for a cause. The ancient scales. Oh my gosh. Anton, we're buying some carbide. Oh, really? There's plenty of canisters. Dozens of them. It is not a problem in India. Yeah, right. That is India, guys. Here you can find anything you want. Imagine if we could buy some carbide in our country like this. That's just impossible. Just take a look at this authentic acetylene generator, guys. The way people look at us here is kind of weird anyway, so I have to wear my scarf like this, not to draw much attention. We finished, let's go and do some experiments. Holy moly, I really don't want to fall off. Where are we, Anton? As I understand, we are in the market. In the matter of fact, India is one big market. Yes. How much? 150? That's little. We have bought a high pressure tap. The sewage. The guys have tried hard, I can say. They have bought this Indian cup, and we're going to make it a rocket fairing. We're gonna weld it. That is not all. We have also bought a metal sheet to cut out rocket wings from it and weld them too. So it's gonna fly. Straightly and with the right course. Oh, we have to replace the tab. That is what happened. There is much of pipe tape. Will it hit me in the face? No, it's gonna be okay, Anton. It is well insulated. Carbide, do you smell it? Yes. Mmm, good. <sighs> he hasn't insulated it with Pakle yet. You remember just in time. Did he say Pakle too? They call it the same way. And we have another word for it. Pipe tape. No way. Let's go, Anton. Show us how to do it. My right hand is stronger. Oh, fuck. <laughs> It's a new tab, but we can't move it. Oh my gosh. We tried. Do you think it's a good idea to move it like this? Once I saw people were kicking them on the ground. Look there, the guys added a coin here. At least someone uses life hacks like this. No poop. Is it waste? Not going to burn? A bit of carbide? We need just a little bit, right? That will be enough to launch 10 rockets. Cool, we can fly home in a carbide rocket. Thank you, thank you. If you place it in the way, it will take time to burn. And now we must close all this mess with a rubber cap. Nasty, and it doesn't inspire confidence. There is no pressure gauge, so we will never know if the pressure becomes dangerous until it explodes. Is it boiling? There is cooking something tasty. Maybe it's semolina porridge. Really? Why the pressure is zero? Ha! <laughs> ah, it's acting up. Acetylene torch. Start. What is it for? I get it. Fire extinguisher. <laughs> oh, serious? Fancy that. It looks like a deodorant. Carbide's burning. He's gonna add some oxygen. Wow. Cool flame. It's a tiny burner. Is there a welding element? Borax or something like this? 
Borex, we should avoid oxidation. That is beautiful. Wow. It is sooting hard. Suit machine. Smoking. He added some. He heats it first and then deep in borax and then welds with it. Awesome. Wow, so awesome. Yeah, super. That is really cool. Look at it. Look how many kinds of wings we can make. We need nice airflow. That's more professional than that time with Petards. He is measuring its size from a smartphone to scale it up for our thermos. We've made the fairing out of a cup. Oh my gosh. God damn it, fairing out of a cup. I hope they are making it right. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. So that's it. If we use bent wings, the rocket will spin while flying. That will make the flight even more stable. What? What is going on? An extension? Maybe he's making the landing site. Well, Anton, will it blow up or not? It is going to explode hard. It's gonna be turned to hell, dude. Nothing will remain. We should keep distance from it, not to damage our eyes. Cool welding. Oh my, it is awesome. I hope it will not explode. Why were I charging it? Because it is a very dangerous kind of fuel. Do you really think it can reach the stratosphere? This fuel is very powerful. It can be true. We're gonna run out of fuel. Too fast. We shall see. Let's test the liquid jet fuel. It's gonna boil and then come down. Oh my gosh, guys. That's a hell of a fog. We need nitrogen to cool the condensation of oxygen. Kerosene? Why are you using it at once? Oh, oxygen. That's bad. You know these things are... Is there kerosene inside? And he's going to add some oxygen there? But we shouldn't do it. Why not? It can explode. You should use two different balloons. Can oxygen and kerosene really explode? Sure, I better stand back. Oh, dangerous. Mommy, screw that. <laughs> Just what you said. It popped. That is not a big deal. We shouldn't mix them. Right. We need two different balloons. For kerosene and oxygen. I have offered him, but he refused and said it's a test. That is just crazy, guys. If it burns, that would be a hell. Living? Dangerous area. Very dangerous. Yes, very dangerous. Don't do it, guys. They are fearless. He has dipped it in it, for real. He's touching it. It's gonna blow up. Something went wrong. I think it was okay. That was a dangerous technique. I saw some jet flame. Yeah, in the beginning. There was some. Yes? Test good? No, no, no. Nasty. So finally they decided to freeze oxygen and kerosene separately. He's filling it from the canister. Cups for liquid oxygen. The thermal insulated to keep cold liquids. It's gonna blow up that oxygen. So we're gonna freeze it. Yeah, classic. Using liquid nitrogen. Slowly it's gonna boil and pop up like this. Yeah, I know. Okay, 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 okay. 
So what's happening? The oxygen is getting cooled inside and it is shrinking until it becomes a liquid. So we are condensing it. The word safety is lacking here. It's okay. We haven't hidden the rabbit. He will be okay. He will just have a drop of it. Look what happened. Oh my. It shrinked. How much of it we've got? Can it break out? Yes, it is liquid. It can get out. So, Anton, that's a kind of unusual. It's a real scientific experiment. We have never made such things. We just don't have these components, so we can get oxygen if we need it. But liquid nitrogen, never. Yeah. There is plenty of it. Holy moly! There is much of it, Anton. You might not see this, but it is slightly blue. These exact chemicals make the sky blue. Is that kerosene? It's going to be frozen. I got it, he's going to put hard kerosene inside. Oh my gosh! It became ice, look here. It is freezing cold. A magnet? Paramagnetic. What does it mean? It is paramagnetic. Strange. Did you know that oxygen can be magnetized? Look at this frozen kerosene. More? There will be boom. It is slow. As you see, our neighbors ran away. Everyone is safe. There we go. The fuse is burning. Oh my gosh. He's throwing away the firm kerosene. He is doing it. The reaction is stable. Yes, good, good. That was like the real jet fuel. Yeah, it was good. Stable. It is not enough still. Let's try another proportion. We need to add more oxygen. It is dangerous, he has lit it. Oh, mommy, it's going to be... The reaction went faster. Why? It is supposed to be burning for long. Is that it? Is experiment se pata chalta hai? The experiment shows yes. solid, no work. Only liquid. Well, you say liquid? Okay, liquid. Let's pour some then. That is going to be harder. That was a hard hit. It's okay? I told you that there will be an explosion. It rings in my ears. That was hard. Bloody hell, that was a flash. The main thing they liked that. Everyone is here. So it wasn't a joke. Oxygen blows up in certain proportions. Why he's going there? Oh, to get this. Well, guys, this fuel is dangerous to use in this rocket. Neighbors got deafened as well. We are not going to stop. We will try to balance the jet fuel reaction and we will send this rocket in the stratosphere. Subscribe and never miss our crazy Indian experiments.